Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's From the Heart with Heather. And this week we're gonna talk about my Costco haul. So I'm gonna go over a couple things. This is what $200 at Costco will buy you, in Louisville, Kentucky anyway. And um, what, how much I save a week on organic chicken, so just one item. And we'll feature savings on other items every week, okay? How about we do that? But um, this is pretty, pretty eye-opening. So what I got for $200, what I absolutely love, and how much you can save at Costco on one item. That's today's topics. All right, so every week when I go, and I do go to uh, Costco every week, I go to Kroger every week. Um, you're like, wow, that's a lot. But we eat a lot, my husband eats a lot, and um, I'll show you how I save money and how I do the click list. Yeah, let's get into it. So. Um, every week at Costco, I've been looking at buying and trying new items. Um, so the first thing I'll go over is the new item of the week that I tried this week at Costco. And I'll preface it by saying, you've probably already heard this if you've been listening, but I don't eat a lot of meat and I don't like a lot of meat. But I have to. I can't go all the way veg. It just hasn't happened for me. And that's okay. I'm okay with that. So I do look for shortcuts on meat. And it is my side piece. And this week's shortcut, I decided to try fully cooked chicken breast bites. And this is a product of Canada. I looked at that. Um, it's raised without the use of antibiotics, which you see that on a lot of um, a lot of these. And each little package, so it's got two, four, six, eight. Um, you'll see nine here, but it came with ten because I tried one. <laughs> um, we got ten packages. The packages are small. The bites are um, 3.2 ounces, okay? Which is not a lot, considering like if my husband eats one of these, he's gonna want eight ounces. And so that's gonna like take about two and a half, three of these. But hey, sometimes when you're in a pinch or if I don't feel like making something right at the moment or grilling chicken for somebody, the this costs around, he took my receipt, so I will verify this next week. But I, I think it costs around $14. It might be a little bit less. But, um, you know, it is a little pricey. But for the convenience, this is a recommendation. This chicken tastes really good. It tastes like the chicken that you make at home. So it doesn't, you know, like sometimes you get chicken um, bites or something that's already made by somebody. And it's like with rib meat or it just has a different flavor no this tastes like someone cooked it and they chopped it up and that's all they did so it's real deal chicken it tastes authentic and um it's worth every bit of the cost to me because i yesterday i didn't feel like making something and i took it and i even heated it up and a lot of times i do not like heating chicken up i just don't like reheating food it tasted great i heated it up tasted good they taste good coat a plus on fresh edition fully cooked chicken bites home run all right so that's one of one part of the 200 dollars haul at costco what you'll get next item is um salmon yuck <laughs> i don't like salmon but they do and so this filet is um it's actually boneless i mean it's um skinless he always makes sure i get the skinless it was, um, I don't know if this is a good deal because like I said, I don't really buy, I'm sure it is, but I don't really um, buy a lot of salmon anywhere else. So for two pounds, 2.04 pounds, it's at $8.49 a pound and it's $17.32 for this much salmon. They love it. Right on to the next. And final thing, and what I'm really going to get into here in a bit is organic chicken breasts. I buy these. This is one of the reasons why I join Costco, okay? Um, you may or may not use this much chicken. You could always freeze it. But this is a, a usually it's nine pieces. It's three in each. So they're vacuum, you know, they're in their little packages. And when I buy them, I always, one, look at the date, naturally. Turn them around, look at the bottom, see if they don't look, you know, make sure nothing looks gross or like bone or just i don't know weirdness looks perfect and so these organic are 4.99 a pound that is a steal it's a steal um other places 
is $5.99 a pound, and that's with a coupon. And oftentimes, you know, if you've got, if you're buying $5.99 at a pound at somewhere else, they're usually packaged in three. So you would need three coupons or the ability for that coupon to, um, to use it three times. So at $5.99 a pound. Or when it's not on sale at other places, it's $6.99 a pound here. I know because I shop on the regular and I hate, I hate paying $5.99 or $6.99 a pound. So it motivates me to go to Costco. But I want to show you just the savings, the savings from $4.99 a pound versus $5.99 to $6.99. Okay. So right here on this package, this weight, the total weight on this one, and I try to, what I do, so this costs $27. 27.15 and I try to buy my chicken right in that range anywhere from five twenty five to twenty seven dollars um that's usually about the like four no five five and a half pounds um I don't anything bigger sometimes the chicken breasts are too big or just yeah that's re really what I buy so it's nine pieces it's five point four four pounds now here's the good stuff okay so at Costco, when I buy at $4.99 a pound at Costco, I am saving, I get it, well, hold on, let's go back. I get it for $27.15, okay, for at $4.99 a pound. When I buy it at other stores, for that same amount of poundage, it's going to cost me $32. If it's not on sale, that same amount is going to cost me $38. And so I outline the savings. So it's $5.44 is what I save on a package of these. That doesn't really sound like too much, but when you add that up, so I go every week. So, and I actually buy two of these, so I'm saving more than that. But say you just buy the nine, nine pieces a week. 52 weeks at $5.44 of savings. I'm saving $282.88. You know, it's a no-brainer. Costco costs $60 to join, and I'm saving on other stuff too, but I couldn't believe. I mean, just $5.44 is saving me $282, and that's on the lowest price. Now, if I, was, if I had to buy organic chicken, this much organic chicken at $6.99 a pound, which that's not happening, We'd probably just have to go to regular non-organic. Um, you're looking at $38 for a package, and I buy two packages, so that's almost 80 bucks. But even just one package, the savings annually on that is $566.28. It's crazy. I love Costco. All right. Okay. I'm off my chicken tangent, but every week I can show you what I'm saving and how I'm doing it. So when I do the click list, so yes, I do shop at two stores and this is the only one I physically usually walk into. Sometimes I do walk into Kroger. That's my other store. Um, when I do not walk in there, which is most weeks, I use the click list and people are like, well, it's $5. But look what I'm saving guys. I'm saving $288, but you know that, that pays for my click list every time. But a lot of times I get coupons for click lists. I cut coupons. Yeah. I'm in procurement. So that's kind of my, kind of my jam, right? I save money. All right. So back to the Costco haul, getting excited. Um, blueberries. So I went through the meat and this is what else I bought. Um, I like their blueberries. I do do organic. They do cost a couple of dollars more, but it's worth it to us. I've already opened these. Um, asparagus and you know I never real um, I'm not sure if they just recently switched this is a different brand but I just noticed these are organic now too I try to buy organic whenever I can not even not just the dirty dozen like the apples and that um, really everything and I feel okay about that so um, one of the good tips on buying these I've, I've noticed is making sure that the date looking at the dates on these because they get so much in Costco. They'll have boxes and boxes of asparagus. So just make sure you look at when they pick this up. Um, something else I've also noticed, asparagus right now is out of season and um, it might be coming back in. I'll have to look, but it's been out and I've noticed that at Costco, they their asparagus looks good all year round. Um, they, this is coming from Mexico. I do wash it off, all of it, no matter where I get it. Um, but I noticed that right now, if I go to Kroger, um, it's not so good. Sometimes they won't even have it or the ends. One of the things I look for when I buy asparagus is the tops. 
I smell it because if it's going, if it's on its way out, it has a bad smell or the tops are dry or the tops are slimy. So, um, pretty, Costco is pretty good on asparagus looking good. Next thing, organic apples. You can see my child has been killing the bag. <laughs> it's a full bag. And it is, like I said, you do pay for the, the convenience of being packaged, but also, um, when I'm sitting down and I'm not cutting apples or if my child's hungry, she can self-serve, it's worth paying a couple dollars extra for organic and packaged. Love it. Next, tried and true. I know we, we talk about these, so this is my favorite. This is my frozen stuff. Black bean burgers, just for when I'm in a pinch or when I want something quick. Love it. Um, the veggie balls, the superfood veggie balls back. Love these. And then we got some broccoli. And there's four servings in here. I've talked about these before. Love it, love it, love it. Um, you can half them out. And it's really easy to cook. It takes probably under five minutes to cook a whole bag of these. And there's four bags in here. Worth it. Um, now on to a little bit of junk food. So our secret, <laughs> our secret savior <laughs> for sugar is our Belveda. Um, I might feature the savings on this because this is an insane amount of packages. You get 30 packages in here and there's four in a package. I think when you buy them at the store, you get maybe, I'm going to guess and say five or six. I'll confirm. Velveeta. And then a couple of non-food items. A big old box of Cascade. So there's 90, 90 packages. I'll, I'm going to calculate the cost on that because these can be quite pricey. And then lemon juice, things that you're trying to make room for. They're just huge, but we love it. We mix those in our morning drinks. And uh, lemon, lemon juice is really good for the morning time. Get, you, get your acidic levels going. All right, and then parchment paper. I usually buy these at Kroger because I like the individual sheets. But I just wasn't making it into the store, wasn't doing quick lists, so I said, why not? Let me try it out. Uh, one thing I did notice about the paper that I do like um, that's different from the parchment paper that I've been buying is it's quite a bit thicker. It almost feels a little waxy. It's cool with me. It's, it's a ton. I'll be using this for a while, but I use this for to hammer out my chicken, um, to place things on, you know, on my baking sheets, so I'm stoked. All right, so that is what $200 will buy you at Costco. And, you know, I'm saving $282.88 a month just on the chicken alone. It really times that by two because I buy two packs a week. And if you want to see more videos like this and you like the content, subscribe and like. If there's something that you want to see or talk about or you want me to look into, let me know. All right, I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you next week for Nutrition Tuesday.